To the seniors, to the full-hearted crew in the orange and blue who ran through four years of wind sprints and box squats, championship moments and seasons of hard knocks. I stand before a class of Olympians and all-stars made up of the engine rowers and the two-three zoners, the total team players and the do-it aloners, the goalies, the sluggers, the coxswains and crew, the setters, the blockers, the soccer teams too, the lax bros and sisters, the end zone performers, the walk-on, the starter, the keep your bench warmers, <laughs> the kids who grab headlines, the stars of reports, and all those going pro in something other than sports. I stand before academic warriors and Stevenson scholars, the kids with big dreams, tight schedules, and endless potential, who promised his mother that he'd be the way out, who promised her father that she'd make him proud, who promised whoever would listen that they were going to be somebody, who promised to follow in the footsteps of legends and yet still blaze a trail all their own. We paid for this education. We paid tuition in sweat on our brow, became educated by the weights on our backs, learned from the limits of our minds and our lungs. We declared that there is knowledge in calloused hands, lactic acid legs, an unfinished essay, and a 5 a.m. alarm, and yes, we learned this together. We hail from different teams, but we made a family here building bonds and baggy manly blues while cheering each other on in the bleachers, comparing morning workouts like battle scars while shouting over that same three-year-old playlist at Lucy's. <laughs> we fly different flags from England to Nigeria, Canada to Columbia, from Compton to Dade County, and, and Queens to Spring Valley, from City Slick to Country Hick, Trumpland and Bernieville and all the spaces in between. When the school needed leaders, you said, let's go on and lead them. You said, it's on us to show them that we mean it then. And we just needed pretense to rewrite the neatest piece for them. Because playing like a girl means hit that step back pistol, Peterson. And I don't want to stop and watch what field our next great feat is in. We started at the bottom, but we're leaving as the leadership. And where the veil of Onondaga meets the eastern sky, proudly stands these student athletes' eyes upon the prize of the promises they've made, the debts they've paid. And every once in a while, their eyes will stray back to this place. We made a home of this place. We authored a story that will long live in shades of orange and blue, and we pushed each other to greatness. Let's not stop pushing here. Syracuse Athletics, Class of 2017, it has been an honor to bleed orange with you. Cameron McPherson. <laughs>